friends, greetings, and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado. I specialize in using nutritional supplements where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality, to your health, and to your well-being, and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body. You are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That is why we are here every day on The Bright Side, helping clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 27 years of practicing pharmacy, I have seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds. Recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle, but what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure. Because the human biological system is a healing system. It's a regenerating system. It is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that healing, renewing, regenerating system a miracle, it really is no miracle at all. It is just the way the body works. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, we're here for you. We welcome your calls at 855-660-4261. That's 855-660-4261. If you've got questions about prescription drugs or nutritional supplements, ingredients you may have heard about, skin care products, skin care issues, 855-660-4261. Likewise, if you have questions about the longevity products, or if you just want to contribute to the conversation, and, or if you want to share a, share a success story, we love hearing success stories on the Bright Side, 855-660-4261 is your Bright Side phone number for you guys who want to purchase any longevity products that you hear us talk about on the program or recommend on the program, including my personal favorite, the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, multivitamin mineral complex powder you add to water and drink. You can find out all about it at brightsideben.com. You can click on the Join the Team link on the upper left-hand corner of the page at brightsideben.com, or you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. They can tell you all about the products. They can tell you all about starting your own business for a one-time $10 fee. You can make some money selling longevity products and enjoy all the tax benefits associated with having your own business. And you can find out all about it by calling the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470. For you guys who want to keep up with the health news or check out my blog, It's PharmacistBen.com. We update it regularly with news stories as well as blog posts. Got a post up, uh, did yesterday on viruses. And I've got one coming up today, hopefully, hopefully be up today on beta glue, uh, beta blockers. I'm sorry, beta blockers. We're going to talk about beta glue can today. Last, uh, last program we left off talking about this immune boosting substance, beta glue can. This stuff is so interesting. It's basically sugar, but with a little twist. It's glucose, it's little pieces of glucose, little pieces of sugar, but instead of just a simple, one unitary, lonely piece of sugar, it's a long chain of sugars, and this long chain changes everything. Glucose as a single molecule is very explosive, very dangerous, it's used for energy, it burns, it explodes, it's stashed away in fat cells, and it can wreak a lot of havoc, aside from the teaspoon of glucose or so that you need to have in your blood for your brain to work correctly. Aside from that, glucose can be very, very tricky stuff and not very nice stuff. But if uh, you take these glucose pieces, molecules, if you will, and stretch them out into a long chain of lots of glucose pieces, you end up with a polysaccharide, a long chain of sugar called a glucan. And a specific type of glucan is called beta-glucan. Beta-glucan is prized in the nutrition business for its ability to affect the immune system. Beta-glucan, or I should say beta-glucans, because it's really a family of compounds. Beta-glucans can fight cancer. They turn on cells that eat bacteria and eat viruses and other toxins. If you put beta-glucan on top of your skin, you can get some nice anti-aging benefits, some nice healing benefits. Beta-glucan on top of the skin can help hydrate the surface of the skin. You can, you can uh, go get some beta-glucan capsules, open them up, and add them into maybe 8 or 16 ounces of water and make a little spray. If you spray some of that beta-glucan solution when you're laying out in the sun, you're going to get some sun protective benefits, non-toxic sun protective benefits, anti-aging sun protective benefits. 
and moisturizing sun protective benefits. If you really want to go all out, throw in some green tea, maybe a little vitamin C powder to your spray. You can amp up the photo protective benefits and make your own photo protection anti-aging sun protective a sun protective spray for the skin, also moisturizing spray for the skin. You can use beta-glucan salves or beta-glucan creams to reduce infection, reduce the likelihood of infection, to speed healing of burns and wounds. Beta-glucan creams or beta-glucan salves can be especially healing for radiation burns, and you can use oral supplements of beta-glucan for uh, spleen and bone marrow issues that can result from radiation exposure. Beta-glucan is found in pretty much all grains. Barley is a very good source of beta-glucan. Oats is a very good, oats are a very good source of beta-glucan. One of the most active forms of beta-glucans is found in mushrooms, which is one of the reasons why mushrooms have gotten the reputation of being a cancer fighter. They've got lots of these beta-glucans for boosting the immune system. If you've heard me talking about bone soup, but you're a vegan or a vegetarian, you know, you can always consider using mushroom soup as an alternative. Slice up some mushrooms, add them to a little vegetable stock, maybe add some coconut milk to make it nice and creamy. And then I throw in whatever veggies you like. The polysaccharides, those long-chain sugars like the glucans, will come out of the mushrooms. They'll come out in the soup, and you can make your own anti-aging, anti-cancer, immune-boosting soup without having to deal with, with meat or with, uh, or with chicken bones. You don't have to be a vegan, of course, to appreciate mushroom soup. But if you're a vegan or vegetarian, you've been wondering, how are you going to get, how are you going to get some of these wonderful benefits from cartilage and chicken bones? Well, you're not going to get exactly the same benefits or as much benefit, but you'll get some benefits by using mushrooms and making mushroom soup. Mushrooms are pro-immunity. They support the immune system. They've got these glucan polysaccharides. They've got other polysaccharides in there, too. And mushrooms are very gut-friendly. They're very friendly for the digestive tract. They can reduce gut inflammation if you're dealing with ulcerative colitis or uh, Crohn's disease or irritable bowel syndrome. Mushrooms can help prevent colon cancer cells from sticking to the intestinal wall. They can reduce the formation of a, a particularly nasty chemical called tumor necrosis factor, TNF. I shouldn't say it's nasty. Tumor necrosis factor uh, is a, uh, uh, an element that kills uh, tumors, but it can also have some uh, irritating properties as well. And, uh, and uh, mushrooms can help reduce the formation of this TNF. In one study that was published in the Journal of Experimental and Molecular Medicine, Researchers showed that mushroom extract, in this case maitake mushroom extract, significantly inhibited the weight loss and colon ulcers and free radical damage, as well as the activation of tumor necrosis factor that are all associated with colon health issues. And we're talking about osteoporosis here, so uh, mushrooms are going to have a connection to uh, bone building as well. Mushrooms can help build bone strength. They're a good source of vitamin D. They're one of the few vegetable sources, or, or plant sources, I should say, of vitamin D. Vitamin D, of course, is important for calcium absorption and for use of uh, use by bone cells. And, and mushrooms are also a good source of copper. Copper is very important for collagen, and mushrooms are a good source of zinc, too. So you get zinc and copper together when you're taking or when you're using mushrooms. Zinc and copper need to be taken together. They're two of the more important and two of the more underappreciated bone health minerals. You hear a lot about calcium, of course, for bones, but zinc is important and copper is important. So is selenium, and you're going to get selenium in mushrooms, too. You'll get the B vitamins also. All of this is going to help protect you from osteoporosis. You always want to make sure you're using fresh mushrooms. Mushrooms can develop mold pretty quickly. When you're shopping for your mushrooms, look for firm mushrooms, plump mushrooms. Avoid the, the little skinny, wrinkly ones. Slime, sometimes the little skinny ones have a little slime on them. You want to avoid that. Store your mushrooms in the fridge. I like storing mine in a paper bag. If you store your mushrooms in a plastic bag, they can sweat out a little bit. But if you put them in a paper bag, that uh, that'll, you'll avoid that leaching out of water, and they seem to last a little bit longer in a paper bag. In the fridge, it typically lasts about a week or so. If your mushrooms dry out, you can soak them in a tiny, tiny little bit of water. Not too much. They're very hygroscopic. They're very water-trapping. They've got those long-chain sugars that absorb water, and they get pretty slimy if you soak them for too, or soak them for too long. All right, I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side on Genesis Communication Network. We'll be back right after this. Hi, I'm Dr. Joel Wallach, the Dead Doctors Don't Lie guy. There's no reason why you shouldn't live to be at least 100 and have a great time getting there. 
And I'm going to give you a free copy of my lecture that tells you exactly how to do it. In fact, after you've delivered a long and healthy life, there should be only two documents in your medical chart, a birth certificate and a death certificate. I'm Dr. Wallach with a warning. If you have a four-inch medical chart, if you take prescription drugs for high cholesterol, high blood pressure, arthritis, joint pains, and other health issues, the medical profession is failing you. They're using you for an ATM machine. My free lecture is going to reveal what pharmaceutical companies don't want you to know. There's been groundbreaking research and discoveries on how to effectively treat or eliminate over 900 different diseases naturally. And it's all in my free lecture called Deadly Recipe. So call toll-free 1-855-79-YOUNG. Again, that's toll-free 1-855-79-YOUNG. 1-855-79-YOUNG. Gold is like nothing else on Earth. From the Romans through the Renaissance, from the Industrial Age to the Space Age, gold has weathered the test of time. For 6,000 years, gold has remained the ultimate store of wealth. According to the World Gold Council and the U.S. Mint, demand is at an all-time high. The stage is being set for the reemergence of gold as the common-sense alternative to a fiat paper currency that gets weaker every day. Midas Resources is proud to offer the hard-hitting report that arms you with the truth you need to protect you and your family from the Fed's plans for your hard-earned money. Don't gamble with your future. Call Midas Resources today and ask for your free copy of As Good As Gold. Call 1-800-686-2237 for the report the Fed hopes you'll never see. As Good As Gold can be yours by calling 800-686-2237. If you have ever thought about owning gold, you must read this report. Call Midas today at 800-686-2237. Wise up, load up at freestriguy.com. Now is the time to get the freeze-dried meats, fruits, and vegetables you want from Wise on sale at freeze-dryguy.com. This delicious, nutritious food is perfect for your emergency preparedness or outdoor recreational needs. It's the food with a 25-year shelf life you see exclusively featured on the popular Doomsday Preppers TV show. It's the same quality line of food the lovely Marie Osmond has been touting all across America. It's the wise investment in your family's future that personal finance expert and radio host Dave Ramsey has been talking about. And it's on sale now through Cyber Monday, December 2nd at freezedryguide.com. So wise up. Shop online now or call 866-404-3663 866-404-FOOD. Make the wise food choice. It's easy to prepare, easy to enjoy, and easy to buy on sale now at freezedryguide.com. We all know that Berkey Water Purification Systems are the most trusted name in water filtration. As an authorized Berkey dealer for over six years and serving thousands of satisfied customers, the Berkey Guy offers amazing specials for Berkey Water Filtration Systems. The Berkey Light Systems include a set of self-sterilizing and recleanable black purification elements that purify water by removing chlorine, pathogenic bacteria, cysts and parasites to non-detectable levels and remove harmful chemicals such as herbicides and pesticides. Order the Berkey Light Systems system today complete with two black Berkey elements for only $231 and the Berkey guy will ship your order free of charge. With the purchase of a Berkey light, the Berkey guy is also offering a set of fluoride and arsenic filters for only $39.99. That's over 30% off the retail price. Call the Berkey guy at 1-877-886-3653. That's 1-877-886-3653. Or order online at GoBerkey.com. That's GoBerkey.com today. America's number one source for independent talk radio for over a decade. We are the GCN Radio Network. From the cancer.gov website, that's the National Cancer Institute website, beta can along with alginate, which is an algae extract, and high hyaluronic acid, which we've talked about in this program a lot, and something called squalane and avocado oil. Squalane is a, a fatty substance, and when it's blended with avocado oil, it was shown to be uh, protective against um, ba, 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 activating the immune system, act as an immunomodulator, protective against burns, and uh, accelerate, uh, shown to accelerate wound healing. That's a beta-glucan. Uh, beta glucan cream along with a few other ingredients. According to this article, this emulsion may accelerate wound healing and may prevent radiation induced dermatitis. Man, I love me some beta glucan. You can get supplements of beta glucan uh, at health food store. Of course, you can also get it from foods. 
mushrooms especially are a good source, and then uh, oats. Oats are a really good source. All grains pretty much, but especially oats. All right, a couple more things I want to say about albumin before we move on to our next bone-building peptide, which, as I said yesterday, may be the single most important peptide in the body. We've talked about it in the past. We will talk about it for a couple of days at least because it's super important for nerve health and for liver health and for fighting cancer, supporting the immune system, as well as for bone health. A couple more things I want to say about albumin. Uh, Albumin is a blood protein, as we've said so many times. If you've had a blood test done and you have low blood proteins, low albumin, and you're dealing with edema and you don't have a severe burn or hemorrhage, you're probably dealing with a kidney issue. And you're probably pre-diabetic, or you may even be diabetic, or you may have some kind of liver health issue, non-alcoholic fatty liver disease or or cirrhosis of the liver. You may have a digestive issue that's impairing your ability to process or intake protein, or you may be on a low-protein diet. I don't like those low-protein diets, and I think, as we said before, protein is the superstar of biochemistry, and you probably want more protein rather than low-protein. Somewhere along the lines of half a gram per gram of protein per pound of body weight, which essentially means if you weigh, say, 200 pounds, you're looking at around 100 to 200 grams of protein a day. That's a lot of protein. If you want to go on the higher side, that's seven scoops of protein. On the lower side, that's three and a half scoops of protein. And I know a lot of people who think that just doing a half a scoop or one scoop of protein is enough. You can tell you're having a protein problem if you're craving bread and sugar and sweets. And if you've had a liver panel test done and you've got low albumin, chances are you've got a protein issue. Either you're losing it through the kidneys, you're not making it in the liver, or you're not absorbing it in the intestine, or you're not getting enough in your diet. Albumin, as we said, is a Swiss Army knife protein. It's got various functions. It's a drug and nutrient carrier. It carries calcium around. That makes albumin very important for bone health. Low levels of albumin are associated with osteoporosis. And we didn't say this yet, but albumin is a very, very important antioxidant. It protects blood vessels. How cool is that? As albumin is floating around in the blood, it's actually protecting the inside part, the lining of blood vessels. Albumin is just basically a big glob. If you look at albumin under an electron microscope, you'll see a big glob with a lot of little pockets. And some of these little pockets get filled with vitamins and nutrients and essential fatty acids and hormones. And this allows albumin to act as a delivery system or a ferry to shuttle these nutrients around. These nutrients can kind of hitch a ride in these pockets on the albumin molecule. Drug companies love these little albumin pockets. They're thinking of using them, or they're trying to use them to deliver drugs. And as it turns out, these little pockets make ideal little neutralizing compartments for quenching free radicals. Oxygen gets trapped in these little tiny pockets. The human biological system is such an amazing setup. It's a divine system. It's perfect, and it's in essence figured out how to exploit a chemical structure, namely albumin, to accomplish three super important life functions essential for health. The same structure can help keep blood fluid, can help keep blood liquidy, it can help deliver nutrients, and it can help protect the circulatory system. When you understand albumin's tremendous, tremendous multifunctionality, it is no surprise at all that albumin levels are a significant marker for disease and ultimately for death. Albumin deficiency is associated with osteoporosis. That's because albumin delivers calcium to bone cells. Alcium, uh, I'm sorry, albumin can also deliver zinc to bone cells. Albumin also delivers vitamin C. Vitamin C's got important bone building properties, bone strengthening properties. So low albumin, hypoalbuminemia, that is low albumin in the blood, can be a factor in osteoporosis. It can impair bone building no matter how much calcium supplementation you're taking. That's why a lot of folks are taking calcium supplements and still dealing with bone problems. If you're not delivering that calcium, if that calcium is not getting delivered to the bones, it doesn't matter how much calcium you're taking. If you're supplementing with calcium and you have impaired albumin synthesis, say, because you've got a fatty liver problem or you've got intestinal problems, you're going to be running an increased risk of calcium problems, of calcification of tissues. We talked about that when we talked about vitamin K, how calcium can deposit in various soft tissues in the kidneys or in the heart or the brain and actually cause these structures to turn to stone. Well, guess what? Low levels of albumin can accelerate this calcification process, because, especially if you're taking calcium supplements, because... 
the calcium isn't going to get delivered effectively to the bone and it could just pile up and end up getting deposited in various soft tissues. And your supplementation strategy can end up doing more harm than good. So you've got to make sure, guys, that you are making albumin, that your liver is functioning appropriately, the intestine is functioning appropriately, and you're getting enough protein in your diet. So albumin is important stuff. Low levels are associated with a whole host of health challenges, including high blood pressure, cancer, rheumatoid arthritis, osteoporosis, chronic infections, edema, circulatory issues, pretty much all degenerative diseases, every one of them, uh, and early death as well, has some kind of low albumin connection. And given the importance of this protein and understanding, uh, understanding the significance of albumin, it makes sense that you're going to want to do everything you can do to prevent albumin deficiency. So how do you do that? How do you build your albumin levels up? You've gone and had a liver panel test done or a blood, pe- uh, blood test done, and they tell you, well, your albumin levels are a little low. What do you do to keep your albumin levels up? Well, I'm glad you asked that because probably there's a lot of things you could do, but probably the most important thing you could do if you suspect albumin deficiencies or if you've had a blood test done and your albumin is under, say, 3.5, which is a measurement of uh, grams per deciliter, the first thing you want to do is look for digestive or liver health issues. If you have a history of any kind of intestinal problem, Crohn's disease, ulcerative colitis, these need to be addressed. Use your Z-radical from longevity. Z-radical coats the digestive tract, got some great healing properties for the intestine, great immune-boosting properties. The Z-radical is one of, one of the uh, understated, important longevity products. One of the big five or six longevity products, in my opinion, it's made with fucoidin, which is a sulfur type of polysaccharide, a sulfated sugar that's found in seaweed. Uh, fucoidin, or uh, fucose is the name of the sugar. Uh, fucoidin, fucose, whatever you want to call it, helps build immunity, helps heal wounded digestive tract tissue. Great for anybody who's dealing with intestinal problems. Use fermented foods. Those are always going to be helpful for everything, really, immune problems, uh, digestive problems. If you have Crohn's disease or celiac disease, probiotics are, all, probiotics are just important for everybody. And fermented foods the same way. Fermented foods are always going to be helpful. Using your digestive enzyme supplements, Longevity's Ultimate Enzymes, with all your meals, apple cider vinegar after all your meals, that's all going to be a good idea as well if you're dealing with low albumin issues. If you're polluting your body with prescription drugs, please understand that your doctor is not going to tell you that the liver is the primary organ that's going to have to clean up the mess after you've taken your poison prescription drugs. I said that. Poison prescription drugs. Your liver is going to be responsible for cleaning up that mess. That means instead of making proteins like albumin, it's going to be using up its precious resources to detoxify your prescription poison. All right. Got more to say. We'll come back from our break and take your phone calls as well. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You are listening to The Bright Side. We'll be back right after this. This alert just came in. This special announcement is for business owners and leaders of organizations who've been waiting for the right time to build. General Steel has made it impossible to wait any longer with rock-bottom prices that could save you thousands. That's right. General Steel, America's leader in pre-engineered structures, is offering buildings at prices you will never see again. Don't miss these prices. A 50 by 100 for under $30,000. You heard right. That's 5,000 square feet under $30,000. Manufacturers, if you need a larger building, try a 100 by 100 commercial building for 129000 You can't afford to rent with these prices. Imagine a 70 by 100 foot church building for under $69,000. With the economy improving and interest rates still at historic lows, you can't afford to wait. So call 866-91-STEEL. Lock in your price now. Take delivery in spring. 866-91-STEEL. That's 866-917-8335. If you owe the IRS back taxes, listen carefully. Sweeping changes to IRS policies will help more people than ever eliminate their tax debts once and for all. And now, I can help you reduce or eliminate your tax debts and end your tax nightmare. Hi, I'm Dan Pilla. I've helped thousands of people reduce and eliminate tax debts they couldn't pay. And after more than 30 years of experience dealing with the IRS, I can tell you there's no such thing as a hopeless tax case. And with the IRS's new policies, it's easier than ever to put your tax debt behind you once and for all. Call now at 800 800- 346-6829 to learn how I can help you. You know your IRS debt will not go away by itself, but you don't have to live in fear anymore. 
Call 800-346-6829. Learn how I can help you eliminate wage and bank levies, release tax liens, and negotiate a settlement with the IRS that will put your tax nightmare behind you forever. Call 800-34-NO-TAX or go to TaxHelpOnline.com. That's TaxHelpOnline.com. To thank you for being a loyal listener, we have a limited time freebie offer for you. Claim your free heirloom tomato seeds, just pay shipping, right now at 123freeseeds.com. These aren't ordinary seeds. These are heirloom, non-genetically modified super seeds that are open pollinated and can be grown, harvested, and replanted endlessly. These survival seeds are actually more valuable than gold in a crisis. Go to 123freeseeds.com and you can get an airtight storage packet of 150 super seeds free while supplies last to say thank you for being a loyal listener. First come, first served. Just cover shipping. Go to 123freeseeds.com now to see if your free heirloom seeds are still available. That's 123freeseeds.com. An e-cig revolution is sweeping across the country. But is yours American-made? Vapria e-liquid by LaSig is. Manufactured in Arkansas with 100% USA-sourced ingredients. And when you buy American, you support local jobs. Vapria e-liquid by LaSig is top quality at an affordable price. The very principle that once drove the American economy. Get great taste with no ash, tar, or smoke. You'll be wondering why you didn't make the change to Vapria e-liquid by LaSig a long time ago. LaSig.com has has everything you need for beginners to the advanced vaping enthusiast with a wide variety of hardware and also imported e-liquid flavors as well. Plus, Lasig smokes the competition with fast, free, same-day shipping, real people customer service, and a 30-day satisfaction guarantee. Support our country and become a vapriot at Lasig.com or call 870-525-1440. 870-525-1440. Lasig e-cigarettes for today's modern smoker. What looks good under your Christmas tree and tastes even better? Big Berkey water filters. Yes, the gift of clean water. A gift that provides a great foundation for achieving good health in the lives of your loved ones. A Big Berkey water filter gives them protection from bacteria, heavy metals, chlorine, fluoride, pesticides and herbicides, VOCs and more. And best of all, a Big Berkey water filter is a gift that lasts for many years with no additional investment. And that saves time and money in filter replacements that other water filters require and are even powerful enough to purify treated, untreated, or even stagnant pond water. As always, all orders over $50 are shipped free, and GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. Order online at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com, spelled Big, B-E-R-K-E-Y, WaterFilters.com, or call 877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-B-E-R-K-E-Y. Gift well this Christmas. Give a Big Berkey water filter. Are you tired of searching for great talk radio? Something more important. Search no more. We are the GCN Radio Network. All right, now we've got Senator Dick Durbin. Or maybe it's Durbin Dick. Democrat of Illinois. With a new bill, I guess, uh, meant to improve the safety of dietary supplements by requiring manufacturers of dietary supplements to re- register said supplements with the Food and Drug Administration. Why the heck would we want to let the FDA regulate supplements? The FDA, Food and Drug Administration, regulates drugs. Drugs are not supplements. Drugs are deadly toxins. They've got thousands upon thousands of, of adverse reactions associated with them every year. A thousand people, th- thousands of people every year, tens of thousands of people a year die from prescription drugs. Uh, nobody ever has a problem with nutritional supplements. Do we really need government regulation of nutritional supplements? Please. Another power grab by the FDA, and if we're not careful... It's going to be more and more difficult to get our prescription supplements in the coming years. Already in Europe, it's difficult. And Canada, it's difficult to get prescription supplements in the appropriate strength. Senator Dick Durbin regulates supplements like drugs. That's from, uh, that's from an NPR story. I guess Senator Durbin was on NPR a couple of days ago talking about his bill to regulate 
nutritional supplements as if they were drugs. All right, we'll get your phone calls here in just a second. I want to just say a couple more things about about uh, protein and albumin. Uh, if you're on prescription drugs, keep in mind your liver is going to have to process those prescription drugs. That means your liver is going to have less resources available for doing the good stuff, making albumin, for example. Your doctor's not going to tell you that. The drug companies aren't going to tell you that. Your pharmacists and the insurance companies, that all of them who are encouraging you to take prescription drugs, aren't going to tell you that your liver has to process these things. It processes them as poisons. And that means less resources available to do what the liver's supposed to do, or, or one of the liver's, liver's most important jobs, which is making protein and making albumin. Getting off your medications if you're on a prescription drug is always advisable, unless you're talking about antibiotics, maybe chemotherapy. But it's especially important if you have signs of liver disease or if you have low levels of albumin. Folks, if you have a degenerative disease, if you have a heart disease, if you have arthritis, if you have an autoimmune disease and you're taking prednisone and you're taking a calcium channel blocker or you're taking a beta blocker, understand your drugs are not helping you. Drugs do not reverse disease. Drugs don't help any degenerative disease, any, 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 period. There isn't a single prescription drug, and I've been studying these things for 30 years, there isn't a single prescription drug that can reverse degenerative disease. There is zero way they can reverse disease states, and all they're doing is putting a burden on your body, costing you a lot of money, requiring detoxification, using up your precious resources and precious nutritional uh, precious nutrition, and they're not helping, so what the heck are you taking them for? Because your doctor told you to? Great. Your doctor told you to take your prescription drug, and that's why we're taking these things? They don't help. They only mess things up. Eliminating problem foods, supporting digestive health in general, doesn't require a doctor, doesn't require insurance companies, doesn't require any money, and it's definitely going to help you a lot more than any prescription drug you could ever take. Adding key nutrients like vitamin E and vitamin C and essential fatty acids, magnesium, uh, MSM, selenium, glutamine. These are all wonderful ways to improve liver health and ultimately to improve albumin production in the liver. Use your Beyond Tangy Tangerine. Get on the Healthy Star Pack. Make sure you're using the Mighty 90. And, of course, the ultimate key to building albumin is making sure you're getting enough protein. This should be obvious because, of course, albumin is protein. If you're not absorbing protein, if your intake of protein is too low, it's going to be very difficult to restore a low albumin level to its normal state. Whey protein and egg protein are great ways to get the amino acids that build albumin. Both whey and egg actually contain albumin. Uh, uh, whey and egg actually contain uh, albumin that you can use. They contain albumin that you can get into your system. If you're vegan or vegetarian, there's albumin and hemp seed protein, which is my personal favorite choice for an alternative vegan-friendly source of supplemental protein. Many of us tend to think of albumin as an animal product, but it's actually found in a lot of plants. Coconut, for example, contains significant amounts of albumin. Grain and seeds are good sources of albumin. Wheat, rye, soy, legumes in general, peas, peanuts, almonds, they all have significant amounts of albumin, as does hemp seed. So lots of ways to get your albumin up, lots of ways uh, to get the building blocks for albumin, lots of ways to get albumin into your system. Tomorrow we'll talk about another protein that's very similar to albumin, and it's also found in grains and wheat and rye, but unlike albumin, this is a a protein that uh, presents a lot of difficulties. Albumin also, uh, albumin in grains can also be allergenic, and a lot of folks who, uh, who are avoiding this other kind of protein may have a problem with albumin, but we'll talk about that tomorrow as we finish up talking about albumin, and then we'll get to our next peptide our next protein that's very important for bone building as well as uh, other other things, too. It's important for, bone health, uh, for brain health, for the immune system, for liver health. And we'll tell you about that tomorrow as we continue talking about osteoporosis and protein and nutritional supplementation. All right, it's time to hit our phones. Our number is 855-660-4261, 855 I'm Pharmacist Ben, and you're listening to The Bright Side. Let's go to Oregon. Greetings, Carl. What's up, buddy? How you doing? I'm hanging in there doing pretty good. Good morning, Ben. Thank you for having me on the show again this week. Okay. What's going on? Well, question of the week. My grandmother, for all intents and purposes, was uh, was very healthy. And when she was around 61 or 62, all of a sudden she developed, uh, well, what happened was the story was she lost her balance and fell forward and broke her hands. And... She had a lot of medical tests done and ran, and, and she was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy. 
she was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy at the age of 62? Yes. Never had anything like that before? No, she was uh, she was a feisty, oh, just a, just a really hyperactive lady. <laughs> right. Very thin, in great shape, kind of an authoritarian personality. Yeah, she was she was something else. She was quite a character. Did she lie to him? No, no. What? what happened was the story about that was is when after she was diagnosed with having muscular dystrophy, within three to four years. Uh, she had died from the disease. Well, you know, I can help a lot of people, and I do help a lot of people, but I can't help people who are dead, unfortunately. Right, right. What, what I'm talking about is I'm talking about a hereditary component. I don't know if I buy into healthy. that. Hered you mean hereditary muscular dystrophy? Right. I'm concerned I, about it. I'm not sure I buy into that whole hereditary thing. You know, we, 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 we've been so bamboozled by this idea of genetics, which is uh, goes under the heading of the central dogma the idea that everything is controlled by your genes. What people forget to mention, and, and I say most medical professionals, when I say people forget to mention, is that genes are controlled themselves by other factors, specifically nutrition, mental health, and emotional health. That's right. Thoughts we think, feelings we feel, nutrients from foods, uh, all control genes turning on and off. This is so important because we are bamboozled by this idea of the central dogma, which says it's all controlled by genes. By the way, as I've said before, dogma means a belief that's accepted without, uh, without evidence, a belief that's accepted on faith alone. That's the definition of a dogma. And the central dogma is the idea that everything is controlled by genes. What people forget to say, health professionals uh, and uh, doctors mostly, medical professionals forget to tell you, is that these genes themselves are turned on and off by other things. So if you're uh, concerned about muscular dystrophy, multiple sclerosis, some kind of genetic health issue, your best bet is to make sure, number one, you're controlling the epigenetic factors, epi meaning above, genetic uh, above genes, these epigenetic factors that come from food, as well as emotions and mental health. Hang tight, Carl. We'll finish up when we come back from our break. I'm Pharmacist Ben. If you're on hold, hang on. We'll get to you when we come back. You are listening to The Bright Side on the Genesis Communication Network. We'll be back after this. Farmers keep livestock lean and healthy with a mineral-rich diet. Then, before market, they cut off minerals, leading them to crave high-calorie grains. If weight control is this easy, why prescribe surgery for humans? Introducing Longevity. You could avoid 900 diseases by getting 90 essential nutrients from Longevity. Check out 90 for Life at tobeyoungagain.com or call 855-79-YOUNG. That's 855-79-YOUNG or tobeyoungagain.com. Longevity. It's all about saving money, getting healthy, and creating wealth. Hi, this is Ted Anderson. Have you ever wondered why banks, stockbrokers, investment advisors won't talk about gold IRAs? They've been available since 1986, yet the financial industry won't recognize the value of gold for your retirement. Gold has outperformed paper investments, yet no word about IRAs. If you would like to have gold for your retirement, call 800-686-2237. Don't get left behind by rising inflation and low returns. Call 800-686-2237. Secure your future and call 1-800-686-2237. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curb appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panels to the wall and it looks like stone. Stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone. At 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-7866. We live in a complicated society. Stressful issues are always popping up. Have you ever been treated unfairly by someone? Have you ever been overcharged for a repair? Have you ever signed a contract or a document worried about identity theft? How many times have you been in those unique situations where you just wanted to call an attorney to find out if you're right or wrong or what your legal rights are? But every time you think about calling an attorney, what do you think about first? That's right. Who do you call and how much will it cost? Our friends at Legal Shield have found a solution. 
With a nationwide network of 6,900 attorneys who average 19 years of experience, Legal Shield's law firms take over 40,000 calls per week helping their members. For less than $20 per month, you can have access to Legal Shield on everything from the trivial to the traumatic. Let Legal Shield stand up for your rights at lsprotection.com. That's lsprotection.com. Or call 855-340-SAVE, 855-340-7283. That's the sound of a 44 Magnum and Trauma Max. A high-tech hybrid Kevlar bulletproof vest from InfidelBodyArmor.com will stop it and most pistol rounds. Trauma Max is a major breakthrough in pistol-rated body armor, and prices start at just $170 per insert. More protection, more stopping power, more mobility, and it weighs less than 5 pounds. Get details at InfidelBodyArmor.com. That's I-N-F-I-D-E-L BodyArmor.com. Hi, I'm Ed Krell, CEO of Destination Maternity. We proudly support the March of Dimes' work to reduce the rate of premature birth. The numbers have gone down in the past five years, but still, nearly half a million babies are born too soon in the United States each year. We're helping the March of Dimes fund cutting-edge research and community programs to help more moms have full-term pregnancies and healthy babies. Join us in working together for stronger, healthier babies. Visit MarchofDimes.com. The GCN Radio Network, providing the world with hard-hitting talk radio. GCN. Great talk radio starts here. All right, Carl, the Truth Raider, muscular dystrophy. Hey, Carl, you there, buddy? Carl, 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 just for, not just for you, but uh, for anybody listening who doesn't believe this idea of epigenetics and genetics. By the way, Doc Wallach's got a new book coming out in March called Epigenetics, which is all about this idea of nutrition and as well as uh, uh, health issues, uh, mental health issues and emotional health issues affecting your genes. Three really neat books that you could read. One is called Nutrigenetics. Uh, and this is specifically about hypoglycemia and sugar issues as it involves genes. And this is an older book, uh, Dr. Uh, R.O. Brennan, B-R-E-N-N-A-N. I wrote that one. Dr. Jeffrey Bland, who's really one of the best nutritionists in the world, in my opinion, uh, he's a Ph.D. doctor, not an M.D. doctor. He has a book called Genetic Nutritioneering. And then Jack Challum, who's kind of a medical writer, uh, he writes a lot of stuff. He has a book called Feed Your Genes Right. And all three of these books describe at length the important connection between nutrition, food, and genetics. That is, food substances and nutritional supplements or nutritional substances that turn genes on and off. Don't buy into this very disempowering medical idea that it's just heredity, that it's just in your genes. If you're worried about muscular dystrophy, you have it in the family or multiple sclerosis or any kind of autoimmune issue, do all the things we talk about on this program to support your immune system, to support the body's ability to heal and regenerate, to support nerve and muscle health, and that means, number one, Focusing on the digestive system, using fermented foods, probiotics, caloric restriction, staying away from crap foods, more protein, more essential fatty acids, stabilizing the blood sugar, that is uh, more protein, using blood sugar stabilizing nutrients like uh, chromium and vanadium, which you'll get in the sweeties from longevity, uh, vitamin B1 and B3, which you'll get in the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, as well as the amino acids taurine and choline. And third of all, making sure you're relaxing, activating the para- sympathetic nervous system, the relaxation nervous system, using deep breathing techniques, uh, as well as making sure that you're on a good nutritional supplement program, like the one designed by Doc Wallach and all the folks at Longevity, as well as staying away from problem foods. And that's the best way to avoid some kind of genetic malady, uh, like an autoimmune problem, like muscular dystrophy, or supposed genetic malady, I should say, uh, like muscular dystrophy, multiple sclerosis, rheumatoid arthritis, diabetes, or anything else that your doctor will tell you. It's just in your genes. It's just your heredity. Hope I helped you, Carl. I got to move on. Anything else you Anything else you want to want to uh, contribute? Yeah, yeah. I, I signed up for the uh, the bright bright side uh, t- Ben team uh, program there, and I sent out a food box to the Phil- to the Philippines nice. for the rescuing them. So nice, good deal. Um, I'm going to try to uh, promote the Beyond Tangy Tangerine, uh, all all the, uh, the supplements, OsteoFX, the EFAs, and and all of the, all of the things with that. To good deal, and promote it. Out. Make sure you're on it yourself, Carl, the Truth Raider. Oh, I am. I'm watching around day. for a long time. All right, buddy. Good yeah. to talk to you, Carl. Take care, man. All right, uh, Sarah in Michigan. Welcome to the Bright Side. What's going on? Hi, Ben. How are you doing? Doing good. How can Great. we help you today, man? 
Um, I have a 19-year-old son, which back when he was about three years old, he had uh, meningitis, which developed into encephalitis, and he was having um, having uh, seizures back then. And um, he was like, I, I don't know if you could say he was in the zone for about a year up until he was a little after he turned five years old, and um, he had to learn how to walk and talk and everything all over again. Um, he does have deficits. He doesn't read very well. He is now 19, like I said. And after 15 years, he had a seizure last month. He never had. He hadn't had one in 15. Excuse me, 15 he, years. He hadn't had one in over 15 years. That's right. Okay, now here's a couple things for you. First of all, if you can, uh, if it's only one seizure, this is going to be a little difficult to do. But if he, ha- he gets them again, you want to see if you can link the seizures up to either specific events or to specific foods that he's eating. Well, he did I- have one yesterday morning. He did have another one yesterday. Morning. Okay, so it's getting it's uh, that's the second one then in 15 years. Yeah, in 15 okay, years. Okay, so you're starting so something's starting to happen here, which is not unusual at the age of 19. You start to go through some hormone changes, and uh, oh. it's it's not unusual for this start for this to happen uh, if he's been quiet for. 15 years and now he hits uh, adulthood if you will and he's starting to get into some problems a couple things for you number one see if you can link those up to uh, the seizures up to foods the biggest problem foods are going to be anything that that, uh, spikes his insulin or lowers his blood sugar causes hypoglycemia this is why the ketogenic diet is so important for seizures it keeps the blood sugar stable We've talked about this before. The ketogenic diet is a moderate protein. Some people say high protein, uh, high fat, low carbohydrate diet. The idea is it keeps the blood sugar stable. When you go into low blood sugar, secondary to to a high insulin levels, what happens is you eat sweets, bread, pasta, uh-huh. cereals, your blood sugar drops, cortisol, which is your body's uh, stress hormone, kicks in, and that's the fastest way to trigger a seizure. So keeping the blood sugar stable is super important for all seizure disorders. The easiest way to keep the blood sugar stable is to up your protein and essential fatty acids and coconut oil can be very helpful here by the way for seizures and then reduce your intake of refined sugars and carbohydrates that's step number one step number two for seizures is use nutritional supplements that can help keep the blood sugar stable the b vitamins are not only important for keeping the blood sugar stable But there are also your brain vitamins, and there are electrical vitamins, and the seizures are uh, primarily an electrical issue. So make sure that um, he's on the B-complex, lots of it, especially in the Beyond Tangy Tangerine. Have him sip on the BTT all day long. That will give him a nice dose of the B-complex of vitamins. Uh, Vitamin C is very important. I'd be doing 1,000 to 5,000 milligrams of vitamin C a day. You will get that in the uh, Beyond Tangy Tangerine. And then a couple of uh, important uh, amino acids, uh, taurine, very important for seizures. I'd be using 100 to 500 milligrams of taurine a day. GABA, G-A-B-A, can be very helpful. I'd be using anywhere from 1,000, 100 to 1,000 milligrams of GABA a day. He may want to take that at night, the GABA. The amino acid glycine, very good for seizures. It's been used to treat seizures actually for a long time, since the 19th. 20s at least a gram to five grams a day of glycine g-l-y-c-i-n-e can be helpful he may want to consider 5-htp which is a form of tryptophan and then magnesium has got some nice brain calming effects i'd be using anywhere from 500 to a thousand milligrams of magnesium get on the have him get on the osteomag which by the way is uh, magnesium plus glycine it's mm. magnesium glycinate so you get you'll get both the magnesium and the glycine that can have a, a beneficial effect on the seizure disorder so uh, last but not least Slow, deep breathing can also help. Low levels of oxygen, hypoxia can trigger seizures. So have him practicing slow, deep breathing. Go get the, uh, if he has a smartphone, go get the app, My Calm Beat or Bio Breathing, and have him practice along with the graphics uh, that will show up on his smartphone. And it's a good way to practice your slow, deep breathing techniques. What I like to do with my, uh, with my app, with my My Calm Beat app, that's the one I have, is I put some music on, uh, and on my iPhone I can listen to music with the My Calm Beat, and I can kind of time my breaths with the music, and it makes it much easier to, uh, to do your breathing correctly, and it makes it, uh, it makes it much more relaxing to listen to the music as you're deep breathing. So that's something else you could do. All right, I've got to move on. Is there anything else you want to talk about? Yeah, the medication that he's on is called Lamotrigine, and I'm scared of this stuff. Well, it's not a nice medication. It's not a nice medication. I'm not going to tell you to get off of it. That's between you and your doctor if he's being treated. Uh, if he's being treated uh, by a medical professional, you have the right to tell the medical professional you want to wean him off the medication. But mm-hmm. when you're weaning him off the medication, make sure that you're using these nutritional All strategies, things. especially staying away from the sugars and the refined carbohydrates and the insulin spiking foods. That's the most okay. important thing to yeah, do. Yeah, because he loves sweets. Well, okay. there you go. More protein. More yeah. protein. That'll help. All right. Well, thank you very much, Ben. You have a good day. Sir. God bless, Sarah. Thank you so much. All right. Sharon in Ohio, what's up? we got a couple minutes here. How's it going? 
going hey, really Jen. well. Uh, I have, how are you today? I'm doing well. What's going on? Wonderful. I have a um, client. I am a longevity distributor, okay. and I have a client um, that has been battling vaginal herpes for some time. She Got keeps, it. She is keeping it from her husband, so now she wants to clear it up so she doesn't have to keep starting How is she it. keeping it from her husband? That's kind of tricky. I don't know. I didn't <laughs> ask the details. <laughs> okay, good. I understand. I don't think I want to know them either. Here's the deal with herpes. Herpes is a virus, as I'm sure you know, uh, any, and it's an opportunistic virus. I actually blogged about it on, on PharmacistBen.com, which will be up hopefully today. Uh, viruses are opportunistic. They wait for an opportunity to pounce. The herpes virus will show up when somebody is under stress or dealing with some kind of nutritional deficiency. So a couple things you want to do. First of all, we want to activate the relaxation nervous system and deactivate or slow down the, the stress nervous system, the sympathetic nervous system. Deep breathing is the best way to do it. Uh, pretty much all the things we just talked about, actually. Deep breathing can do it, and keeping uh, the, your intake of insulin spiking foods down is also important. When you go into low blood sugar, secondary to insulin, that can trigger uh, cortisol and the stress response, and that can make it easier for a virus to attack. So keeping uh, your sugar intake and your refined sugar Sugar intake, refined carbohydrate intake down. Using nutrients that support sugar metabolism can be helpful, uh, and that is all the ones we've just talked about: the B complex and and taurine and choline, niacin and thiamine especially. Uh, and then there's a couple really neat antiviral supplements you may want to try. Selenium is the most powerful of the antiviral minerals. Uh, zinc is also important. I'd be doing about 600 milligrams of the OPC selenium, 50 milligrams a day of zinc picolinate, and don't forget about good old vitamin C. Very important for the immune system. Uh, I'd be doing anywhere from 1,000 to 5,000 milligrams of vitamin C a day. The Beyond Tang Tangerine will take care of your vitamin C needs. Thanks so much for your call, Sharon. Appreciate it. And thank you to all our callers and letter writers. I appreciate all you guys. We'll be back at you tomorrow with more good health information. I am Pharmacist Ben. Thanks for listening, folks. Have a wonderful, beautiful day. We'll talk to you all later. Bye for now. It's time for a home security quiz. What effective home security device is smaller than a coffee cup, fakes out burglars into thinking someone is home at your house while you're away, plugs into any wall outlet, is recommended by many police departments, and sells for less than $30? Yes, it's fake TV. This year, about one in every 50 U.S. homes will have a break-in, with burglars usually picking the easy target, a dark house that looks like no one is home. Fake TV is a small electronic security device that makes it look like someone is home watching TV by simulating the light from a real TV. Fake TV could be the difference between coming home to a secure house or one that's been ransacked. To get your fake TV for only $29.95 with free shipping, go to faketv.com or call 1-877-5-FAKE-TV. That's 877-532-5388 or go to faketv.com. Fake TV, the burglar deterrent. American gardeners and fellow patriots make the right choice with your money, time, and your family food supply. Choose 100% pure heirloom seeds in the Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com. Why spend more? The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com is only $37.95 and includes 20 varieties of pure, hardy, easy-to-grow heirloom seeds. Yes, only $37.95. That's 70% less than our competitors. You could buy three Survival Seed Vaults for less than one of theirs. The Survival Seed Vault from MyPatriotSupply.com includes detailed planting and seed saving instructions and ship same day. Plus, all orders over $49 ship free. MyPatriotSupply.com is American owned by patriots like you. Passionate about freedom and preparedness. Call now, 866-229-0927. That's 866-229-0927. Or discover more emergency preparedness items when you order at MyPatriotSupply.com. Choose the original. Choose the Survival Seed Vault at MyPatriotSupply.com.